Kicking off this morning with some sunshine. We've kicked out the rain from yesterday. Now we're entering a dry streak as we head our way into the week here. Take a look at our weather cameras over Portland now. Beautiful start. A lot of sunshine to kick off this Tuesday here, but we are expecting a few more clouds to roll in with a mix of clouds and some sunshine through the afternoon out to Mount Hood Meadows. Loving that shot there. Blue skies over the summit there. Just a, a lovely start over the Cascades. Out to Kalama, that's up north. We are seeing mostly cloudy skies over the river there and out towards the coast. A bit of clearing this morning. Lincoln City looking gorgeous as we start this uh, Tuesday. There's your view again. In Portland and much of the Valley. We are in the upper 30s to low 40s. So that is jacket weather. Uh, bundle up out the door here. We'll see a slow warm into the 50s. Our highs today in the mid 60s by the afternoon. So ultimately not that bad as we head into our lunch hour and beyond. We'll see some pleasant weather today as we stay dry and get some sunshine. In terms of rainfall, our April to date actually should read there closer. It's about a third of an inch of rain. Our deficit uh, just over two inches. So again, we are missing quite a bit of rain for this month and there's a good shot here that we go down as a driest uh, April ever on record. That is rare to see here. Usually we get top 10, maybe top 15, but uh, to see the number one driest April ever on record is concerning because that is setting the stage for an active wildfire season here or for at least a dry one. Uh, so again, not good to see that. The last couple days have brought uh, a little bit of rain Sunday and Monday, a few hundredths of an inch of rain. Saturday, we saw a soggy morning, but as we head into our week here, we're not expecting much more rain. And because of that here, our drought through the month has increased. Uh, we've gone from about uh, 70, 80 percent of the state at some level of drought. Now we're sitting closer to 95 percent. Just in the last week here, we've really increased our drought. Even some excessive exceptional categories out towards Klamath and Lake counties out in southern and central Oregon. And again, these statuses have not been seen since the early 2000s. So we are very dry going into our wildfire season. We're not quite there yet, but the summer months we will be on our toes here watching out for wildfires. So again, this week we're expecting high pressure to roll in. We've seen this pattern before, it brought us a couple of 80 degree days several weeks ago as we head into our week here and that ridge starts to bump over across the West Coast and Pacific Northwest. We'll see some warming, so expect to see dry conditions, some warmth and a good amount of sunshine. Just a great week for outdoor activities by the weekend. That ridge again breaks down, so we'll see a westerly flow here, more zonal flow, and that will allow for a weather system to roll in. And again, by Friday through Saturday, we'll see some light showers back in the mix. Not expecting enough rain at this point uh, to again kick us out of that first place running for driest April ever on record, but we will likely see some measurable rain by Friday into our Saturday and then throughout the weekend. So we'll watch this very closely. We would love to see more showers, but we're just uh, seeing this dry pattern setting up and continuing this week. So today we'll see a mix of clouds and sunshine for a mostly cloudy finish to the afternoon. Partly sunny for the coast today. Some sun breaks out there as well. Mid 50s, not a bad day out towards the beaches in the gorge today as you head through Hood River and eastward. Expect to see some breezy winds on I-84, also up in the mountains too. Pleasant day for Central Oregon. Highs there in the low 60s. So here's our seven-day forecast. The warmest day of the week will be on Thursday. Right now going with the upper 70s, but a chance we do see some more warming. Maybe we hit 80 degrees there on Thursday for the third time. Uh, so far since March. So again, it's going to be a warm week and a dry one. Get outside and enjoy the weather. Our next round of rain arrives Friday night throughout the weekend. Back to you guys. Thank you very much. Time now for